biggest opportunity comes from the, the role that uh, Poland plays and will play in uh, Ukrainian war, meaning supporting Ukrainians at the moment and then supporting Ukraine uh, reconstruction. This means that uh, we will have even more uh, demand for logistics assets. There will be new shoring process coming and uh, all this will, will together create a huge opportunity for Poland but also for other sectors. It will start with logistics, but then it will move to um, residential properties and probably others as well. Lacking of some bigger investors from, uh, from Western Europe, maybe an opportunity for our domestic investor. But uh, the, the, the biggest maybe challenge is, is could be also the lack of capital, uh, especially a lack of funding, uh, because most of the banks will now be focused on some maybe more mature markets and some bigger deals, and maybe they will, you know, shift their attention from, from Serbia and Belgrade. I think the big opportunity we see is the, the, the kind of intense tenant engagement we've had over the last couple of years and really strengthening the ties with our tenants means that we have a very clear idea of what their priorities are, how uh, we need to adapt um, our, our portfolio to, to adapt to kind of changing demands, whether that's been consumer driven demand, whether that's uh, the, the impact of technology and, and the pandemic. And I think we have a very clear roadmap of what the future looks like for, for our types of properties, which is, which is really exciting. And it's, uh, it's good to be equipped with that, that, that kind of clear information. To keep up with the market, uh, possibly to also um, make the current trends uh, corresponding with the inflations, because uh, the, uh, it might be some um, difficulties to achieve that. To achieve that. However, with some uh, more unified policy from the landlord side, it's, it's kind of doable. And if rent, uh, retail rents speed up together with, uh, with the rest of the economy, that should also be reflected in the possible uh, um, prices on sales of this kind of assets, which, which we hope that will come sooner. This year uh, has been mainly marked by the unfortunate humanitarian crisis uh, of, the, of the Ukrainian war. Uh, which created disruptions in sort of uh, value chain and construction materials specifically, which makes it more difficult to build today and to into fixed price contracts with GCs, with developers. Uh, and that is a challenge that there's no any easy answer to. Uh, and I think it's the single largest challenge of this year. We hope that with the passage of time and the conflict uh, receding, uh, um, uh, you know, this will be this will be overcome. And so this year, I think everybody just needs to uh, demonstrate a bit more flexibility and creativity and continue staying in, in, in business. We need to know our markets. That's why we stick to our core market like Romania, Bulgaria. And uh, we need to know the clients to be close to them and to react to their needs, to, to be more flexible. Uh, if you talk about the offices and to adapt and to cater to their needs. Right now, there is a, there is a need to make a huge leap towards sus sustainability. And it's going to uh, be a huge business opportunity for new companies and existing ones. The, the biggest challenge is to is to find, you know, for each sector is to find, uh, I guess, the new point of equilibrium, like the rent levels, the yield levels, the interest less, right, rate levels. It's, uh, it's a lot is happening uh, also in terms of, you know, currency, in terms of occupational costs, energy costs, etc, etc. So there are plenty of vectors like aiming at different directions and then and the biggest challenge is to make sense of it yeah but this will happen i mean market will always uh, adjust the opportunity is uh the fact that poland is still a very very attractive place it's with relatively uh, low uh, labor costs with relatively low rent levels uh you know with plenty of space for further development and investment so that's the that's the big opportunity for poland